Hi guys, it's Bobby. Uh, welcome back to my channel for another video. Um, today I thought I would do like a little plan with me and my new um, Mocharm Lux 2.0 Personal Wide in the color Pebble Gray. So if that sounds like something you'd be interested in, stick around. Okay, so the first thing I'm going to do is grab my pen and grab my Tombow N95 marker, all right, or highlighter, whatever you want to call it. I'm going to go to my weekly section. Oh, no, actually, you know what? I'm going to go review my monthly real quick uh, to see what we've got coming up. So, week of the 8th, so my kid's birthday, got an appointment at the bank, and then bonus daughter and soccer. Okay, so I'm going to go to my weekly i got to do my weekly review for the week before, so I'm going to take that out. Um, and then this week here, take those out. Okay, I'll stick those under the weekly review. Then I'm going to flip through to my dailies. Uh, da -da -da -da. All right, so Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. So I do a daily page for every day, just so I have some place to, you know, write my to-do lists. So and then I'm going to go back to my to-do lists, and I'm going to see what, if any, of these things can get done this the week, you know, this week, so that I can keep moving forward with my goals and stuff. So you know what? I'm just going to take that out and set that off to decide. Okay, so that's that. Uh, let's see. So daily pages up there. And you know what? In my last video, I mentioned these inserts and it looked like they were, these were Q1, Q2, Q3, Q4. So I made the comment that we don't have a Q5. These aren't Qs. So welcome to old age. You know, I should probably have my glasses on. It's, this is zero one, zero two, zero three, zero four, zero five. So week one, week two, week three, week four, week five. So I'm an idiot, but anyway, so, um, so there's nothing wrong with the insert. So, um, actually let me get my book back out here. All right. Let me go to the week that we're working on. Okay. So this was the week of nine to 24. All right. So let's see. All right. How was this week? Um, for a short week, it was long. Um, and it was somewhat productive. You know, I got a lot done um, throughout the days, even though my weekly doesn't look like I had anything planned too much. But so I'm just going to write long, productive, and hmm. I'm going to leave that there for right now. Um, I feel grateful this week for, obviously, my husband. Okay, nice weather. The weather we've been having here in Delaware here lately has been amazing. Low to no humidity. Um, nice breeze, cool temperatures. It's been wonderful. And then the third thing I'm grateful for is family. Okay, small wins of the week. Okay, um, let's see. <clears throat> Excuse me, let me go back to my daily pages to see what all I did throughout the week so I can find out what my wins are. <clears throat> Excuse me, okay, so I called the bank. Okay, made that appointment. Um, let's see. Oh, I ordered ordered carpet. Okay, that was a win. Let's see. Mm -hmm. 
and <clears throat> excuse me I cleaned the house okay so um what's going well hmm so I'm gonna say uh, getting back into my planner because I haven't really been doing that um, as much as I used to okay um, tasks in progress oh do, 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 do. let's see I don't think I have anything left in progress that I didn't finish this week or over the weekend so I'm gonna leave that as blank for right now um, things I can improve on you know this is something that's always gonna be an ongoing thing and I'm just gonna be I'm just gonna write um, prioritizing and um, managing my time I mean, I can always get better at both of those. Uh, what's not working? Hmm. I don't know. I don't think anything's not working at the moment. I'm going to have to think about that. Um, so I'll come back and uh, fill that in. Um, next week, I'll be focusing on, okay, I'm going to do job search. Because, you know, I've been out of work for a couple of weeks now. And it's it's been nice. It's been like kind of like a little mini vacation. But I'm... Um, driving myself up a freaking wall here so you know uh, I need to get back on on that overall thoughts ideas and notes um I'm just gonna put it was a good week um, um a lot of thoughts about the future okay all right, well, that was my first uh, weekly review. Um, let's see, this was the first week of September, so I'm just going to highlight 01 there. Um, okay, so I'm going to stick this back into my uh, weekly right after this last week. All right, and then we'll get into my actual weeks here. Okay. So this is the weekly insert that I use from Haru Plans on Etsy. I am really loving this shop's inserts. I, you know, recently downloaded um, some additional inserts. Uh, let's see, my personal section. So the TV series tracker and then like the reading journal. So I'm, I'm really loving the inserts. If you can see here, TV series tracker and the reading journal. I'm really loving these inserts. Um, I, I just, I don't know what it is. I just like the simplicity, the clean lines. It's just black and white. It's just simple. You know, it's not busy, you know, so I just, I like that. Anyway, we'll get back to the week here. Okay, so what I like to do is, you know, I've already filled in the, um, the month and then the days. I did that on my laptop. And I just printed. So um, what I'm going to do is I always highlight the week that we're on. So this is the week of the 9th through the 15th if it starts on Monday. So I'm just going to highlight that with my Tombow. And I number the days. So Monday is 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 13, 14, 15. Holy smokes, guys. Okay, first of all, we have a Friday the 13th this week. And Sunday is the midpoint of September already. Oh, my gosh. Oh, I can't. This year is just flying by. Okay, so... And what I typically like to do um, is if I have events or something that's timed, I use the fine point on my Tombow 
to make the dot. Otherwise, I just use my pen to make the dot. But today is, um, well, Monday is um, a, a special occasion. You know, my youngest one turned 20 at 12.59 p.m. So probably after, you guys will be seeing this afterwards. So I'm just gonna draw a little box there. I don't I don't do much as far as like decoration, you know, things like that. Um, I used to use stickers and whatnot, but I, I just don't do that too much anymore. So I'm just gonna, you know, fill this in a little bit. Just, you know, squiggles. Doesn't have to look pretty, you know. I just wanna set it apart. All right, there's that. I'm going to stick that to the side for a minute. While I'm waiting for that to dry, I'm going to move on to Tuesday. So I know I'm going to open up my monthly again. So I know Tuesday, um, we've got a 1030 appointment at the bank. So I just do the little dot with the Tombow 1030A PNC Bank. Okay, so I know that that needs to happen. All right, so I don't have anything going on Wednesday or Thursday as it stands right now. Um, I don't have anything going on Monday either except for my kid's birthday. Um, now, Friday, bonus daughter comes to visit. Um, so, just wanna make sure that I'm still in focus here, still in frame. There we go, maybe that's a little bit better. All right, sorry about that. Okay, so typically, um, when the weeks that bonus daughter visits, I usually put that down here on the side. I don't typically put it in the the weekly, the day of the week spot, because um, I don't use this for much of anything else. I'm, although I will be tracking my steps or miles walked um, on my treadmill in this section. So, um, and then we've got soccer on Saturday. So, let's see. Let me go ahead and do Saturday. Make a little dot. And then um, it is 11.30 a.m. soccer. And it's on field six. Okay. So Friday, what I'll do over here in this section is just highlight. And I also highlight on Sunday because that's when we have to take her home. All right, so All right, so there's that. Okay, this should be dry by now, so Gosh, I can't believe my youngest is 20. Oh, Lord. Anyway, okay. So now um, I fill in my um, habit tracker. Now, the habit tracker is the same, you know, every every single week. And I love, I, I love checking these things off. You know, it shows that, you know, you know what that sense of accomplishment feels like. So I'm going to do, um, it's vitamins. All right, it's dishes, make bed, um, make tea, okay, walk, read, and daily review. Okay, um, if I don't do it, so like make tea, Make tea for me is like, I make sweet tea by the gallon. It's not like I make a, you know, I don't have like a, a cup of hot tea every day. I make sweet tea by the gallon. So, um, I don't usually make it every day, you know, because we have two gallons in the fridge pretty much all the time. So, um, the day I make tea, I'll check it off. But if I don't need to make tea the next day, I just put like a little dash in it. So, Everything's filled in, but um, it doesn't necessarily mean it was completed. Okay, 
So, and then we've got the checklist down here, priorities. So, okay, let me say priorities is job search. Priority one. Um, priority two is carpet. All right, because I ordered it, so we have to we have to get it installed. Um, but, um, and then priority three is going to be uh, bonus daughter's birthday. Okay, her birthday is next week, so uh, she, her dad, and I are going to be celebrating this weekend. So we're going to have to get her cake and you know go shopping and all that kind of fun stuff. So. All right, Sunday, um, it's always a weekly review. All right, weekly planning. And fill vitamins. I fill up, I have a, um, I have a pill box with the days of the weeks on it, the days of the week on it. Um, and I just put all my vitamins together for the week in there. So that way it's easier for me to just, you know, dump them out. I take, you know, multivitamin, vitamin D, B12, um, ashwagandha, I take that. I take um, a probiotic and I take prenatal vitamins um, for my hair and my nails. Um, so that's in my skin. So that's, that works well. I get all that stuff from just, you know, like Walmart. Um, okay. So the checklist section, I really don't use this section too much because I, you know, as you see, I write pretty big and this spot's pretty small. So, um, but I will just, you know, put a couple of things in here. So I'm just going to put grocery list. All right. Um, I don't know if I'm going to order groceries this week or not. Um, because, you know, we've got to go, we've got to go out on Saturday anyway for soccer. And we'll be out tomorrow for the bank, but I doubt we'll, we'll do it then. Uh, cause my husband has to get new tires tomorrow morning as well. So, hmm, I don't know. I don't know. We'll see. I'm going to have to go to the store anyway on Saturday after soccer to get bonus daughters, um, ice cream cake. She wants an ice cream cake. So that's that. Um, so that's, that's my week pretty much as it stands right now. All right. Um, and then what I do from there is I put that back in my book. Um, and then I use that to do my daily pages. So these are inserts from SM plans. Um, I use all of them. I, you know, again, can't punch my, can't cut my inserts the same way or the same size anyway. So what I do here is, um, up here at the top, I'll just write the day of the, the week. So it's Monday, it's nine, nine. Two, four. Look, I started right oh four because that's my kid's birthday, nine nine oh four. You know, so anyway, so and typically my days always start out the same way. I write my, on my daily pages the same things every single day uh, to start, and then I fill it in as I need to. So I always put a dot, and then I just start with take vitamins. and then dishes, and then it's make bed. So every day, you'll, you'll see these, these three at least every day on top of my, the top of my list every day. Um, okay, so let me look at my to-do list. Uh, did you, I don't wanna clean the oven on Monday. No, no, no. I don't even know if I'm gonna paint the chair anymore. Uh, da, 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 da. Oh, look, D-Stash. You guys, I've got a ton of personal size um, planner covers. i got a couple Moterm, and then I've got um, a Vanderspeck I'm going to be looking to get rid of. So if you guys are interested, um, the one personal size Moterm that I have is just you know, the Pebble Gray that I just bought. The other, Another one is um, a Pink Croco. The pink croco and then um the vander speck is the touch me parm in the pink color um i'll throw in some pictures if any of you guys are interested you know let me know we'll see what we can work out oh i need to update my indeed resume okay so i'm gonna do that so um 
put that on to on Monday's update. Indeed resume. And since I'm going to be on my laptop anyway, I'm going to do clean laptop. Um, oops, laptop. All right. And then record plan with me. Okay, I'm doing that. Print sticky notes. Okay, I'll do that too since I'm on my laptop. Print sticky notes. Okay, and I think that's going to be it for Monday. So, and then what I'll do is on, I flip it over and I just go Tuesday. 9, 10, 2, 4. Here we go. Take vitamins. Dishes. Make bed. So, <clears throat> And then I'll go through, you know, tonight, right? Or Monday night when I sit down. Like, yeah, tonight, because it is Monday. Tonight, I'm going to sit, when I sit down and, and finish up my, I'll do my, like, daily review. I'll see what else I can do on my to-do list. And then I'll fill that in for Tuesday. So, you know, the rest of this is just going to be, um, oh, you know what? Tuesday. Gray dot. 10.30 a.m. PNC Bank. Okay, so that's our appointment at the bank on Tuesday. All right, so this is 9-11. Oh, gosh. Oh, goodness. Okay. So, take vitamins. Dishes. Make bed. All right. So every night when I sit down to do my daily review, um, I also go through um, my to-do list, my running to-do list. Um, I forgot the date already. Um, to see what I can add, you know, just to fill up my day and, to, you know, to keep things moving along. Um, sometimes I don't do anything. Sometimes I just do the three things that are on my to-do list. Um Oops, look, I can't. I can't write and talk, you guys. Dishes and make bed. So, sometimes these are the only three that I do. All right, so Friday on the 13th. Ugh. Uh, take vitamins. Okay, so now Friday is a little bit different, especially since, you know, it's um, our weekend with Bonus Daughter. So I'm just going to highlight a little section up there at the top. Um, just so um, it catches my attention and... You know, just put that stuff in there. So now I need to figure out what's for dinner. Um, so I need to plan dinner for Friday. Um, typically she wants to order out all the time. Um, I swear the child doesn't know what it's like to eat a home cooked meal. Um, but I, you know, we don't order out very often. So, um, I always try to have something here, um, for us to eat. It's, it'd just be her and I, you know, Friday night, um, her, her dad works second shift. So, um, it's just her and I usually here on Friday nights and, um, we just we hang around, you know, girl talk and have dinner and, you know, sometimes we'll do nails. Sometimes we, you know, we just, she turns on these, um, she's really into stray kids. Not sure if anybody is familiar, but she'll turn stray kids on, on YouTube and, um, we'll just listen to music and whatnot. So, but, oh, I do know. Pardon me, on Thursday, I want to pluck my eyebrows. So I'll do that there. All right, so Friday's pretty much, you know, done. So, and Saturday, you know, we've got soccer. Uh, 
9, 14. So, but I'm still going to do take vitamins. All right, and then up here at the top, just highlight, all right, soccer, ah, oh, what is she on? She's on field six. All right, so, and I know it's a bit redundant, but I like to keep it down in my events as well as an event. So 11.30 a.m., soccer, field six. And then um, afterwards, we're going shopping. And then I need to plan dinner. I think we're going to do like French bread pizzas. Um, you know, homemade French bread pizza. I'm not really sure yet, but we'll see. We'll see. And then, you know, we've got Sunday. All right, so Sunday is a little bit different. Um, I usually sit down and do my planning on Sundays, um, but that all depends on um, how things are, you know, with Bonus Daughter on on the on our weekends with her. Um, I don't like to take that time, you know. She's she, she's going to be twelve, so she's you know getting into some some stuff that I'm into, like she finds this whole planning thing fascinating, um, but um, she doesn't really understand a whole lot. And sometimes when I try to explain it to her, um, like I can see her eyes just glass, glass over. <laughs> so, um, but I always sit it down or set it down. I always uh, write it down for Sundays. Uh, and then I fill my vitamins um, on Sundays. And we typically always have a crock pot dinner on Sundays, um, especially now that, you know, the temperatures are cooling down a little bit. Um, so I just don't know what I'm going to have for dinner on Sunday yet. So, um, all right. Uh, but I'm going to put on here, start dinner. Whatever that is. Oh, and look, Saturday, I need to uh, do the laundry. And I'm a bit of a weird one when it comes to laundry because I don't, like, laundry to me is not a blanket thing. To me, laundry is washing and drying. So, um, and then I write down uh, fold clothes. And then I write down put clothes away. Okay, so that's what I do with that. All right, so that is it, you guys. That's, you know, my weekly planning in a nutshell. Um, and um, as I go throughout the week, you know, when things get added um, or, you know, completed, uh, I will, uh, I, you know, I, I update accordingly. So let me just take this here. And put my book back together. So this goes over here. All right. This goes in here. All right. Put my to do list back where it belongs. All right. And then flip up to my daily. Daily. Oh, these are the daily reviews from the week. I'm going to take those out now. Okay, so put my daily pages back in here. All right. So I'm going to get started on these. And, oh, I've got my daily reviews, my blank daily review inserts. So I'm going to stick that. I'm going to stick this one in here just so it doesn't cover up the page. I don't know. I haven't figured out the best place to keep those yet. 
um, the blank ones. I, I like having them, at, you know, with the, the day to help you know, remind me, but uh, writing it, you know, writing it down. Oh, I didn't write it down on the daily page. Maybe I should write it down on the daily page and keep the daily review inserts in my personal section. I don't know. I'm going to, I'm going to play around with that for a little bit. Um, let's see. I am going to write a uh, daily review. Um, I mean, I know it's on my habit tracker and my weekly, um, but you know, I don't, the only time I flip to this is when I need to update the habit tracker. That's pretty much it. And you know, it's what prompts me to update the habit tracker is the, the things that are on my habit tracker are on my daily page, you know? So I need to also, um, update my habit tracker over here. Um, for yesterday, I did not do a daily review yesterday because I don't know that I want to do those on the weekends, you know? So, um, let's see the eighth. Oh, I didn't do my mood either. Eighth. Um, doo -doo -doo. let's see yesterday. I was a little bit stressed yesterday. Not a lot, but you know, just a little bit. Um, so, oh, and you know, I told you guys that I, um, I like found this stuff on like Amazon. I don't remember what it was called. I don't know. The stuff that I bought wasn't that specifically. It's this here. Um, it's a lot thicker, but it's still, you know, pliable or whatever the word is. So I just cut it in half. I got the five by seven size. I cut it in half and punched it. Um, so it um oops it has a little lip at the bottom instead of the top you know so i'm using that you know to turn it to my tv series tracker i need to fill it in with um the next show like i'm i'm watching Chesapeake Shores right now i'm sure it's i mean it's old i, I tend to watch things as they go they go out you know instead of when they actually are on the air um, I think Chesapeake Shores came out in like 2016. So like, what, like eight years ago. So yeah, anyway. And the next, um, the next one that I uh, will be adding is Sons of Anarchy. Um, neither my husband nor I have seen Sons of Anarchy. So we started watching that. Um, but anyway, um, I don't know where I was going with this, but, um, I do need to add the straight edge to my habit tracker for my mood. Oh, that's where I was going with this. Jeez Louise. Um, so the other half of the stuff is here. So I just, I used this yesterday, I think, when I updated this. Oh, let me go this way. And uh, just, whoops, just draw the lines. You know, connect the dots. Okay, so there. It'd be interesting to me um, to see by the end of the month, you know, if my mood was up and down or pretty even, you know. Um, I don't know. You know, the end of the month is coming quickly, you guys. That's usually when I have a menopause symptom. So, I don't know. We'll see what happens. But anyway, um, so that's my weekly planning. Um, I hope you guys have enjoyed. Um, hope you guys have enjoyed that. and. Um, I will see you soon. Thanks for watching. Bye.